Hello everyone, in this video we want to talk about how we can rank or scores or something in the Excel without using any formula. So here we have some scores for some students and I want to see each of these students rank from 1 to uh, 32 students. So uh, we do not want to use any formula so we just want to use a data analysis add-ins in the Excel. So if you go to the data tab and you can see data analysis add-ins here. If you cannot see these data analysis add-ins, you should go to the file options and then in the add-ins, press go button and then checkbox these two analysis tool pack and then press OK button. And after that, you can see the data analysis tool packs here. So uh, press the data analysis tool back and then uh, go and find the rank and percentile option and then press OK button. And then it asks you to uh, the input range. The input range is the range that you want to rank them. So right now I want to rank the score column here. So I go and select the B1, throw to the B31. And I will tell that my data are in the column. So if your data is vice versa and are in the rows, you should checkbox the rows. So right now I just need to checkbox the columns. And if you notice, the first cell is a score, which is my label. So I checkbox my label and then I can tell the Excel to give me the report in this sheet by selecting the output range here or creating a new workbook for me. By selecting the new worksheet, will generate a new worksheet, and I can name this worksheet by the ranked data. So after you press the OK button, it will generate a report for you and telling you the point 21 is the first rank with the score 91, and it's in the 100 percentile. Uh, the first point here has the score 73. 0.85 if I come here I can see my first point is 73.85 and it's in the and its rank is 10 and it's in the 71 percentile almost 71 percentile so this is how you can generate fast ranked data but right now as you can see I have the point but I do not have any student names how I can have the student names here in my report. I just need to insert a new column here and then specify the point one is here, point two is here, and then select these two and double click on this little one here. And then you can see I have all my points and then go back to the ranked data and say, for example, names and use a simple VLOOKUP function. So in the VLOOKUP function, I want to tell the to Excel to find this point in this range, range from A to B actually. We do not need column C, we just need column A and B. And I'm telling to return the column 2 value with the false match. So close the parentheses and then press enter bottom and then you can see you will Excel find your student name which is student A21 and then double click here to have all the student names in your report. So you have a report for the rank of the students and with their percentiles. Actually, in the most cases, I use the rank function and percentile function in the Excel. But when you want to have a very fast and separate report, you can use rank and percentile in the data analysis add-ins. Thanks for watching. Until next, goodbye. In order to watch more training videos, please subscribe to our YouTube channel, Diaco.td. And if you want to see our products, please visit our website, diaco.co.uk.